Welcome back to Learn SKN, and today we're going to look at some, just some, of the broad topics that CXC released for the upcoming May June 2022 exams. And so they decided that they made a promise that they were going to release some of the broad topics, mainly for paper two. And so they did. But they did, but not quite, because it's only just a few subjects. So CX is dropping these topics like albums now. So it's release one, and then they say 2.0 would be released by Friday the 13th, May, Friday the 13th. So that's later on this week. This week. So let's just see what release 1.0 has in store for us. And keep in mind that even though these are the broad topics, this is mainly for the paper two. This is just the topics that they are going to delve deeper into for the paper twos. But really and truly, all topics are going to be covered in paper one. But they're just showing us which ones we should just dig real into. And so before we start, you know what to do? Like the video, subscribe to the channel, and hit the notification bell so you know when Learn SKN drops release 2.0. Last time they did this, they made a revision. So I'm not too sure if they have enough time to make a revision because you know exams start uh, May 23rd and so maybe at this point in time they might not have time to make a revision so this might be the final for release 1.0 and then the final for 2.0 but we'll have to wait and see what CXC decide so what are we looking at today now for, for on the CXC side of things as it relates to this channel in particular let's look at agricultural science single and double award and so we kind of focus mainly on single award here, but double award, they have paper one and two. And so you can see the topics that are going to be really, you know, the nailing, drilling down in. So we have economic factors of production, farm organization and planning, structure, anatomy and physiology, that's of the plant, animal nutrition and management, environmental factors affecting crop growth, harvesting, post-production management, conventional and non-conventional crops and livestock farming systems, importance of agriculture in, the nation, in national, regional, and international economies, animal nutrition and management, you know, pest and disease management. And so you can see that basically paper two would be the same for, of course, single and double award. What the difference is now paper three, where uh, for the double award, you have entrepreneurship in agriculture, Communications in agribusiness, nursery management technologies, technologies for non conventional crop production, post production handling and processing of livestock, management practices in rearing livestock, housing requirements for different classes of livestock, agro engineering, appropriate care and maintenance of simple tools and equipment. So, those are the topics for agricultural science. And then they go on to outline the topics for history. So, you can check the link in the description below to go there and see what topics they intend to cover for history and those other subjects that we don't really really feature prominently on the channel so if you go down you have chemistry edpm english b food and nutrition social studies technical drawing clothing and textile and that is it for release 1.0 for CSEC subjects that's the broad topics that's it so they ain't cover econ or pob just yet I guess we'll have to wait for release 2.0 to cover to see what they mentioned for those other subjects. So they're going on to Cape subjects now. And so we're looking at, let's look at management of business if they have it. Let's see, let's see. Yes, they do. And so for paper two, you're going to cover economic sectors and legal structures, business objectives, decision making in business organizations, group and team management, strategies for managed conflict. To manage conflict sources of financing need for accounting information components of financial statements and then for paper three we have types of economic activities economic sectors legal structures formal organizational structures function of management communication in organizations uh, accounting ratios budgets and investment appraisal and so that is it for the Cape as it relates to what we cover here on the channel. And so you can just go and hit the link in the description, see what topics 
that they decide to cover for the paper twos but once again we have to look at all for the paper ones paper one cover all of the syllabus right so keep that in mind so if you go back a bit and look at the syllabus for agriculture science we, we're looking at just the single word for now single word you will see that they left out the whole we will see exactly what they left out things like specific objective one agriculture science and agriculture we don't see that on the topics objective two the role of agriculture and support services that is not on the list for for topics to cover for agriculture for single award looking at single award they kind of started from the economic factors of production and that would be all the way in section d right that would be section d right economic factors of production and then we're looking at also farm organization and planning so that's all that is really related to section d of the syllabus just those two looking at farm organization and planning and economic factors so we're not touching marketing for that section keep in mind this is for paper two single award remember paper one covers everything on a surface level in a sense paper two goes deep so they're saying it's not going as deep as with marketing or any of those things or the ones that i mentioned just now the earlier part of section a you're looking at objective one and objective two of course they start looking at object they didn't even touch objective three because there's nothing here about challenges of agriculture which is a nice topic i would have loved to see that but that's not going to be touched too deeply for paper two right and so what else they're not touching here if you're looking at the crop section they are not touching anything in land prep right of course you're touching anatomy and physiology that's that's part of it they say it right here right anatomy and physiology and so i guess that goes for both animals and plants in this in this case so they're going to touch that so you have to learn your parts of the flower parts of the roots parts of this parts of that internal structure parts of the animals you have to learn all that stuff right for paper two but they're not touching the they are not touching crop land prep which would have been what section they're not touching genetics section three genetics no right section four land prep they're not touching that and it doesn't look as though they are touching as i said before marketing but most other things are on the table for crops and and livestock right now if you're looking at let's say management right management of business for cape it seems as though they would have excluded a certain amount of things also for example for paper two in particular look at paper two we're looking at paper two they would have excluded the for paper two types of economic types of economic activity that ain't they ain't touching that one they ain't touching uh ethics right no ethics there's nothing about globalization that they are touching based on what they are saying here on the topics right so they're not touching anything on globalization so if you look at the syllabus here they are saying business and its environment let's see what they say in the topics just economic sector and legal structures that's where they started from right so no business objective right there no economic economic sector and legal structures that's where they kind of basically start right there so that's part that's part that's two but there's nothing for one types of economic activities but for paper three of course look at right there so for paper three you have to cover that one and then what they're, what else they're not covering let's look at ethics there's nothing there about ethics there's nothing there about globalization so that's module one so for module one it was basically covering decision making process business objectives let's say decision making process and economic sectors and legal structures now if you're looking at module uh two now we're looking at module two functions and theories of management that's out organizational structure that's out theories of motivation that's out 
leadership that's not mentioned group and team management i think that's where they start group and team management right there that's where they started and then strategies to manage conflict so cause of conflict strategies to manage conflict nothing about management of change nothing about communication in business nothing about human resource management we don't see that on the broad topics right here we're not seeing it then they move to module three and i think they left out a whole bunch from module three based on the topics right here right they start touching module three at need for accounting information and components of financial statements and so you realize that one need for capital not seeing that sources of finance there we go sources of financing right there criteria for seeking finance i ain't seeing that management and capital market not seeing that need for accounting information right here components of the financial statement components of the financial statement right there financial statement analysis that's not on the list of topics that they gave but again keep in mind paper one covers a whole lot of these things on a surface level um eight budget and budgetary control that's not in the topics investment appraisal not in the topics and so that's module that's unit one right they ain't drop nothing for unit two as yet right nothing dropped for unit two as yet for management of business all right folks so that's about it you can always check the link in the description to di di um, dig deeper for yourself download the pdf so that you can be guided accordingly use that in conjunction with your syllabus so you know where to go hard where to ease up a bit but you have to cover all still some deeper than others that's the key point you have to cover all but some deeper than others for those for the paper two drill down for the paper one only just just know what they are right so we're gonna stay here for now remember again like subscribe hit the bell so you know when learn skn drops the other part of the topics for 2022 exams right thanks for watching thanks for listening